आप सब वेलकम और वेलकम बैक टू हील सोल टैरो दिस इज जियाना योर ओन टैरो का रीडर एंड द साइकिक हीरो माय फ्रेंड्स आई होप यू आर ऑल डूइंग वेल हेल्दी हैप्पी सेफ एंड साउंड सो गाइस टुडे इज रीडिंग इज ऑल अबाउट हाउ वेयर एंड व्हेन यू आर गोइंग टू बी मीटिंग योर फ्यूचर स्पाउस फ्यूचर पार्टनर योर लाइफ पार्टनर ओके but for that you need to choose your pile and you can see three options coming up in front of you pile number 1 pile number 2 and pile number 3 so whichever is calling you most you can choose that i will see you on your reading and your time stamps are given down in the description box and yeah i will see you there Hello and welcome pile number 1 if you chose the first option come on let's see what comes up for you how where and when would you meet your person okay so let's see pile number 1 you getting a hang in the man oh my gosh this is king of cups interesting How will and when are you going to be meeting your person? Knight of Cups, King of Cups, Two of Cups in the Reverse, and this is a Seven of Pentacles. Well, first of all, let me tell you, Group Number One, that you know this is not your ex partner. Okay, and you have not met this person right up to now. Okay, and uh, of course this is your soulmate, but you are still searching for them. You are still trying to find your soulmate. To do who are this person? Like who is this person, right? So I can see that uh, group number one. This person might be having water sign placement into their chart, like Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Mm -hmm. Maybe Sun, Moon, Rising, or maybe the uh, Venus. Okay, so group number one, your person, the very first look of you, this person would get hypnotized. literally this person is going to be falling for you king of cups clear clear cut message that you know this is the love of your lifetime lifetime love compassionate very generous such a gentle man that the person like who is literally <laughs> pulling a chair for you on a restaurant kind of stuff or bringing you uh roses flowers right or tulips whatever you want hangman of course stunned literally <laughs> stunned and this person can not take their eyes off of you cannot stop thinking about you and this all is such a romantic setting this person loves you for however how you look like and your overall personality and yes this is right that this is going to be love at first sight knight of cups love at first sight they are going to be liking you getting inspired from you and they really cannot wait to propose you right away <laughs> because they do not want to know more and more about you because i don't know why maybe maybe this person is your soulmate they recognize you and you recognize them and they don't want to explore more because why because they know they already know you and uh, they know that you know uh, you would be the best person and you are the one who is made for them this is kind of energy such a surety such a contentment i can see which is literally unable to explain like that very surety and stuff and like security uh, what this person is feeling about you mm mm-hmm. 
So this is what I see here for group number one. So I just want to see, you know, what could be the setting, like, you know, where, what place. It's a once. What place, universe? Please guide me. Five of hands. Three of swords reverse. Mm. Magician. It's something magical. Some place which is magical, like it holds its magic. It's a famous place where you would visit, okay? Could be a certain um, that museum, any historical building, some historical bridge or some like building stuff, right? Mm, you were there for your literally exploring your artistic side, right? And this person was also there. It could be uh, some old library as well. But if you are into, you are not into like books and stuff, it could be a bar, okay? Some club. But that place is so unique, so beautiful, right? And it's a night time. Literally night time, right? Hmm. You were there, you went there, you visited there just to just to feel much better or maybe just to just to explore something, just to find peace and calm and serenity for yourself. And there's there's the place where you would literally meet this person. They would also they were also there for exactly the same reason you were here of sorts. But because this is Eight of Swords and Eight of Swords represents that, you know, this person would be feeling like confusion or being trapped because they don't want to let you know on the very first place that they, are, they have fallen for you and now, you know, the ball is in your skirt. <laughs> they don't want to tell you that thing, but, you know, it would be visible from their eyes. It would be visible literally quite there because the eyes are very, very expressive. You would feel like that. And you would literally know whatever they're thinking about. You would get to know that, you know, this person has fallen for me. And, you know, in their time, this person would literally ask me <laughs> for date and literally, you know, have a relationship with me. That the reverse. You see, maybe you're stuck in your past partner, your past boyfriend or husband right and you need to move on right you need to end that very connection just cut the emotional cords and move on are you listening to me if you are stuck in your past you need to move on right and do not miss the upcoming blessed opportunities blissful environment bliss you see the abundance which is approaching towards you. Do not do that to yourself. Do not do that. Literally, this time is quite crucial. And you need to accept what has gone is gone. Mm -hmm. You see, new blessings are waiting for you. And you know you need to be literally open about that, right? Just being receiving mood. You, you deserve much more than you think you do actually like <laughs> you are made of stardust yes you are a magical person you see magician you have manifested your person by yourself by your powers by your vibration and the magic you have created let me show you the magic that you have created by yourself you can see this you know that stardust and stuff like that do not Like, do not um, derail it, okay? Do not end it. It's magic. This is what I want to tell you. Well, let's see what's, what will happen next. Three of Cups. Oh my gosh, this person would literally ask you for a luxury, beautiful, romantic uh, place for a date. 
okay or maybe for a romantic dinner dinner lunch anything the next day or maybe at the you know coming weekend so you are going to be enjoying your beautiful calm serene time with your with your person right i believe number one you would accept their proposal because literally i can see both of you roaming around walking on the street having fun going on a date and you know this person is so gentleman so respectful that they know that you are coming of course they would be literally reserving that very table or like restaurant for you you know <laughs> so you would be feeling so special at that very day maybe you would be wearing red maroon or black colored dress on the very first date with your person hmm so this is what i know about it ten of wands reverse you will feel so relaxed they would make you feel like you are healed now and this was the person for whom you have been waiting for since or since your whole, time, whole life right so this is what i know about you and your connection but you want reverse this is such a broad-minded person they don't they don't have to stalk you you don't have to keep an eye over you whatever you're doing if you're dating somebody else or not because this is such a secure person at their own because they know that if they are treating you well you are theirs this is what their belief is so let's see oh <laughs> you know let's see what happens next from the oracle okay pile number one from Oracle, you can see the sick red woman oh my gosh you have got a very strong character maybe you are not the person who would literally say yes to everybody out there for dating hmm. you have got priorities you are quite picky in this relationship uh, matters especially so this is what they are going to be observing and you so you are not a random person you know so mate oh my gosh congratulations group number one i knew it i knew it since from the start of the reading that you will literally manifest it your soulmate oh my gosh this is so cute so beautiful and such a transformative phase in your life when you would finally manifest your soulmate right so of course there is spiritual connection there is love for lifetime and of course there is love at first sight and you know rest would be the history <laughs> so you know the freedom such a person who wants a good connection with you would really wants you make you feel secure in their embrace right another thing is a divine masculine divine masculine energy is when somebody knows their responsibilities when they know that they are the person who has to take the charge like into providing you and protecting you okay so this is how they are they are into their masculine energy so they would literally provide you and if you want financial benefits from them of course i'm being very blunt here this person knows that it's their responsibility and you would not regret choosing them for that life purpose i believe you both are going to be fulfilling your life purpose together because as they are your soulmate and of course you are born for this for a special soul mission and both of you are going to be literally uh, helping each other to um, like pursuing their dreams and do whatever they want to, whatever their passion is, their soul mission is. So, they're quite abundant person, like lovely. Spiritual maturity, they are mature, quite mature person. Mm -hmm. 
like spiritually, emotionally. And they are the true partner, I believe, here. This tired masculine. Maybe this person's life before meeting you was a mess, like literally in organization stuff. And after being in a relation with you, they've found their true mate in you. Okay? So as far as the time frame is concerned, pile number um, one, I believe, uh, because I can see the 12 number. 10 number, 19 number, and 33, 27, 34, and 30. Okay, so these numbers or maybe these ages are quite important for you. So if we talk about the exact time frame and you are going to be missing this person, so I give you the time of seven months, at least seven months, and max to max, it's going to be. 11 months 7 to 11 months are you see anything can happen during these months and stay ready because energies are aligning and you would manifest your true person in these months so 7 number represents the july month and the 11 number represents the november july to november july month and especially the november month is also very very crucial so you need to get ready to embrace this connection and up to the up to the time you do not meet this person like that very time frame in between you need to focus on yourself okay love yourself take care of yourself pamper yourself just have fun with your siblings or maybe your you see, my loved ones, right? And literally take care of yourself, especially your health. Because part number one, I can see some of you, you are not well, like health-wise. You are facing some issues, like maybe gut health issues, or maybe gut health, or maybe heart health. I can also channel somebody having extreme hair fall or skin breakout stuff. You need to take care of that. Mm-hmm so let's see some charms for this connection okay let's see some charms group number okay group number one this is triple seven you are extremely lucky extremely lucky group number one there is energy with a fire sign. They are super ambitious. Never give up, given up on you. Oh my god. This is a heart. And this is, you see, the thunderbolt. Like literally, you are going to be uh, blowing their mind. This is fresh energy having strong feelings for you. Okay. Again, fresh. So again true feelings emotional attachment with you it also represents they could be pisces or any wire sign pisces cancer scorpio they are glasses so maybe they wear that gemini energy they have such a jolly person they're such a jolly person and like sense of humor they, they like to have fun and having very cool personality this is Monsieur. They do miss you, okay? You are my everything. This is their affirmation. Or maybe make you sure about their love. Dark night. Maybe they are going through their spiritual awakening stuff. And it's the dark night of their soul. Or maybe it's the night time when you are going to be meeting them. This is I love you confession, sad songs, or maybe slow songs. They enjoy that. Maybe jazz music kind of stuff. Wedding card. <laughs> oh my gosh, this person is going to be proposing you for marriage. So of course, it's a red cross, which is healing your heart. They love your smile. This is the missing piece of heart or broken heart. So, you see, 
They're quite sensitive, I believe. Infinity sign. And finitely, they are into you. Another thing is cancer again, water sign. Oh my gosh. So emotional. Caring. 10 number. Mm -hmm. October month. Romantic feelings. Queen tiara. Queen treatment. 8 number. Uh, yeah, 8 number. With the karma. Um, because 8 number represents karma. And also the infinite abundance. Okay. So this is 9 number again. The abundance number. Again, maybe their birth year is either 89 or maybe 98. You never know. Okay. So wait a little bit more. And this is music. So yeah, that's it for today. I hope you enjoyed your reading pile number one. And I will see you in my next reading. Take care, baby. Love you. And bye. Hey my loves, welcome. Welcome pile number two if you chose the second option. Come on my love, let's see what comes up for you. So group number three, uh, sorry, group number two. <laughs> this is group number two. So let's see what comes up for my love, pile number two. Six of swords, reverse. How, oh, where and when are you going to be meeting them? Ten of Wands reverse, Six of Swords, Ten of Wands, both are coming up as a reverse, and yeah, I just want to pull this card. So Four of Swords reverse, in bottom of deck is Wheel upright, Wheel of Fortune upright. So this is such an incredible um, energy, because there is all about something to do with a restart okay there's a restart you see ten of wands reverse of course somebody is literally coming up and helping you in something okay so if you are feeling burdened if you are feeling uh, like extra responsibilities on your shoulders maybe you are stressed or maybe you are tired of any any certain thing you see four of swords reverse your disappointments are ending that tired period that everything which you are literally suffering in is going to be ending very soon why because you deserve it and it is your destiny the will you have already faced a lot of struggles and uh, like hard times it's time to literally have your fruit okay and since six of cups uh, six of swords reverse literally this person is uh, uh moving towards you okay and they are coming towards you and basically maybe even if this is a foreigner or not they are coming towards you they're coming to your city to your country to your home okay so this is coming back this is coming towards you this is a pull which is literally a pulling them towards you so uh, as far as the wheel is concerned you are fortunate enough to literally manifest your dream partner because they are your dream partner okay so if we talk about the wheel card this is divine timing this is a divine timing and this is luck literally you are so lucky okay so uh, this person is also going to be very very lucky for your financial gains and for your finances overall so i just want to check out the exact place um you see where are you going to be meeting them the ten of pentacles okay ten of cups in reverse the full it's just a private setting it could be your home or maybe your friend's home right this is not a public place such a private place um i believe or maybe this is going to be your office your private cabin okay where you go where you, where you do work maybe this person is literally coming up straight there right and this is your all over your you see your, your own premises your own area where they are coming 
so it could be your home your garden your um something to do with the privacy maybe you are, you do have an office or maybe you run a salon kind of stuff or maybe some massage center kind of thing or maybe you are going to be visiting some uh, doctor maybe right this person literally coming up and showing you up you see you are going there for a personal problem okay for your personal issue to get resolved it could be a doctor it could be maybe or maybe some law thing can be a court or some police station but you are literally going for some literally very very private matter and they are standing there or maybe they were already there or maybe they were helping you there so this is how i can see that okay hmm this person is also very private and if you ask them to keep the secret this person is literally going to be saying yes because they know that you know it's good for them to literally take this stuff like the way for a words reverse hmm. well you have not you have not met this person right now hmm. this is a stranger Yes, of cups reverse and you see this person literally not coming up like straight forward asking you for that stuff this person would tell you to just wait or maybe 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 they would literally ask you random things about your personality and likes and dislikes or can casually ask you to go for coffee with them but still this person is so thoughtful and they will literally check out how you react to their personality if you like them or not this is how they are okay so this is what i see this person is not very very bold not very confident even to pursue relationships because because they're, they're shy or maybe towards it okay or maybe they're hesitant literally to pursue for certain relationship so this is how they are this is their personality <laughs> queen of swords reverse yeah they are uh, not very confident to talk to or maybe they are having some fears inner fears to let you know that they do have feelings for you this is how they are okay so they are not very vocal about it they won't maybe they could be getting uh, giving you uh, hints that they are interested in you but not that that very state for everything no 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 <laughs> mm -hmm. they're super shy <laughs> and queen of wands but this is your energy you are going to be looking so so stunning so attractive such a powerful personality and so beautiful that this person is literally going to be considering you as their ideal one okay and they really appreciate your efforts whatever you put in and also your confidence level also your like and the way you pursue things the way you do things the way you carry yourself this person is literally going to be falling for all that very stuff <laughs> so this person is so confident about your um like personality the love you for how you look like and your confidence and you see you're you're just stunning literally you're stunning in, in their eyes and they literally literally want you as their partner and they, they're going to be feeling so lucky to have a partner like you hmm this is how they are let's see pile number two this is six of wands they are successful it could be your graduation ceremony or maybe you're winning something for your personal achievement maybe some prize or some bonus that very day when it, it is possible that you're going to be meeting them you are very happy that very day you got promoted maybe you see something to do with your happiness with your love and with your how you like things to be happening in a certain way this is how this person is coming to and meeting you on that very day 
and of course you're going to be making that very very memorial like literally uh, memorable and this is how they are <laughs> knight of pentacles they could be your co-worker you never know co-worker and they secretly had secretly have a crush over you they like you like literally <laughs> maybe they don't want to let you know about it but they secretly like you they're falling for you that they, they, they know that you are somebody who can be their potential future spouse you see group number two i believe this person is looking for somebody who is reliable reliable and uh, on whom they can count on like literally trust on because they do have trust issues they cannot try everywhere out there because they, first of all they do not have much time and also they don't want to literally waste their energy on any random person now so they are into like uh just focus on one stuff and carry forward that very person with you you see throughout your lifespan so this is <laughs> how they are also this is the three of wands this three of wands is literally waiting for you and certainly this person is waiting for you okay yeah they are waiting for you and maybe maybe this wait is outside some coffee shop or maybe they are waiting uh, for you on your way maybe your way back to home okay and they, this person stalks you this person looks at you this is also possible because they are waiting for you and this is a very very crucial aspect to for you to know that the world energy this is a secure connection first of all and this is your love of a lifetime world card represents that you know one cycle in your life is ended now and yeah now you need to move on towards a new start new chapter of your life this is how life is about you okay and the world energy also tells me your wish fulfillment right maybe the love and support which you missed in your previous relationship this person is coming up and tell you that you deserve more you deserve more and this is this is uh, the way they are going to be treating you this person um would let you know literally you would feel like that you know i literally wasted whole years on my ex and this was the person with for whom i am made of like <laughs> made for like oh my gosh nine of wands this is such a passionate person such a passionate person and i can see both of you guys enjoying together a lot king of pentacles reverse so first of all group number two uh let me be very clear this is a job person maybe they do not have very very big and you know mansions and stuff they are not a multi-millionaire or billionaire but this person is having so much for you to offer okay from their salary so this is how they are but there is a potential that maybe in the future they will literally consider uh, you know establishing a business but the time when you would meet them this person is just a job person but as far as their work is concerned they're quite punctual very hard working and they keep receiving bonuses and stuff like that and you know frequent promotions they are quite intelligent and quite able person like skillful man right so let's see more hey who's your person group number two such a lovely reading and let's see what's more the divine masculine this was what i was talking about okay they are your divine masculine and they are extremely you know masculine energy whenever your person is into masculine energy they are super super protective 
a full provider and they know that you are their responsibility okay they are not escapist and they don't want to run away from their um, duties kind of stuff okay so this is how they are very responsible and you know they know how to do stuff and you see they're never gonna leave you this is freedom you see this person is such an open-minded person they want to um they want you to do whatever you want to in your life as well as in your private life so this person is literally giving you a open hand if you really want to take charge on um bad when they are okay with it and they're literally going to be liking that your courage your initiative stuff right so abundance of course abundance is coming um pile number two this person they are locked their fortune is always on their side okay as i mentioned before that uh, this person is going to be earning money but in the future okay like literally a large sums of amount i'm talking about like being millionaires and billionaires of course right mm. but at the very time you would meet them at that very time maybe this, their financial situation is not that much good which is going to be happening in the future mm -hmm. because they would be working on their financial situation at that very time of course, they are really very good in commitment. Hmm. They are commit committed. You can see this one. They love thing. They love symbol. I believe you both would be committed to each other. Extremely loyal. You can also see the moon behind the scene. Which is literally an indication that there is love. There is emotions. There is feelings between both of you. Also, I can see the stars twinkling. Literally, this is your destiny. Okay, so you see, I can also see water. So Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. And um, the Earth sign, Taurus, Capricorn, and Virgo. There's a high chance of them being like that, like in their uh, sun, moon, or rising, or maybe Venus. Hmm. So self-respect, <laughs> they do have this thing, like literally an ample amount of um, thing, like they do have great self-respect and also they know that how to respect you as well. As generally speaking, this person is also quite respectful and they know how to pay respect to others, okay? As you know, only that person can give, uh, you see, other person respect who are respectful by themselves, right? So this is a truth and this is how they are. Because they themselves are quite a respectful kind of person and they know what is the respect actually, as in, even if it's uh, the private relationship. And of course, this person is coming up and literally uh, respecting your uh, first of all, the private space and then your, like, honor and, you know, just um, doing the stuff however you like it. So, this is how they are. Mm -hmm. So, let's move on towards uh, some charms and other stuff for group number two. Let's see more. Okay, okay, group number so let's see what comes up. For the time frame, I literally can see group number two that the coming 10 months to one year. Hmm. 10 months to coming 10 months to one year, like 12 months I'm talking about. This person would be into your life as partner like maybe life partner or maybe your boyfriend stuff like that okay because this person you literally stole their heart <laughs> yeah you stole their heart they could be taurus so taurus energy is also somebody who is so so committed to their commitment 
right this is sagittarius so maybe they do have a very good sense of humor mm -hmm. they do have cool personality with the sagittarius energy 10 number as i told you that 10 months are quite crucial in the coming 10 months star energy maybe this person is far off from you right now but do not think that this is going to be happening for good okay because the distance is shrinking and you both are coming together the sweets um like this person maybe they love chocolates or maybe croissants or maybe maybe macarons you never know maybe they do have a sweet tooth okay so yeah this is please a comeback okay this is a busy so they are always busy in stuff. They love music. They love your company. Scorpio energy again fixed sign, which is like they are quite stubborn in their likes and wants. So once they are into you, <laughs> they would make sure that you know they get you. Friendship. Hmm, maybe your friend or best friend would have a thing to get both of you together. This is two number, which is union. And of course, I know union is coming. Please come back. Oh my gosh, somebody is calling you from 4F. And somebody is literally dying to mm, see you. Because this is complete comeback message twice. So you can consider somebody. Maybe you know who is this person. Well, this is I love you. And this is a love confession. This is a rain. It could be a rainy day. So I love you again. Love confession. You are my other half. Free bird. This person prefers and prioritizes the personal freedom. And of course, the freedom of you, your mindset, um, like selecting them. Again, music, it could be their hobby or their profession as well. So seven, a number, a number of being lucky. So also this is a blush on, which is like literally you would blush <laughs> the time. They would make you blush and or maybe they love your chubby, cute little soft thing, uh, soft cheeks. <laughs> the romantic feelings with the pink heart. Mm -hmm. Romantic feelings. So yeah, that's it for today. Group number two, I will see you next time. Take care, baby. I love you. Bye-bye. Hey, my love, and welcome. Welcome a pile number three. So, if you chose the third option, my love, let's see what comes up for you. How to find the reverse. Okay. How to find the reverse and three of swords reverse. Interesting. Our friend to reverse three of swords and this is ten of wands reverse nice this is interesting and so powerful nine of pentacles upright so first of all let me tell you group three if you had some heartbreak in your past and you have been facing some traumas okay and three of swords is literally representing me that maybe you have gone through divorce or maybe breakups or maybe financial loss or maybe loss of somebody who was quite dear to you or near to you right universe wants you to enter in a new chapter of your life okay then it wants to reverse the burden is going away okay and you are going to be feeling light. You are going to be feeling so relieved, calm, and in the serenity. Why? Because the universe wants to literally bless you with somebody very big. And the first, uh, first blessing which is approaching you is your nine of pentacles, your financial freedom. 
okay, your own business, your own job, or maybe you're going to be starting a new brand or some digital marketing. Maybe you are going to do some trading. You never know. In your future group number three, you are a big businessman or businesswoman. Okay, and this is your message. This is your sign to become a multimillionaire or even billionaire in the future. Right? And pile number three, this was your message. You are queen, you are king, and just embrace your energy. Nobody else can define you. Nobody else can literally represent you. You are you. You are unique and embrace this very thing. Do not wait for somebody to come and save you. Why? Because they are not more powerful than that of you. You are a whole thing. You are a whole... Um, you are you're somebody new, like literally so you're somebody who's very powerful. You do not need anybody, yes. But after some time, after when you are ready, like literally when you are your best version, universe is going to be sending a person to join you, right? But you do not need them. You want them, but you do not need them. Keep this thing in your mind. There is a huge difference between wanting and needing somebody or something. Okay? And why I'm telling you all that? Because I want you to let you know that do not underestimate your powers. Okay? Because this will literally um, lower down your vibration. And rest, you know what would happen if you lower down your vibration, right? Obviously, the blessings would fade away you would start feeling lost and you would literally you see lost your way okay so just back up and let me tell you that how are you going to be meeting this very person first of all five of swords reverse mm, this is such a calm and cool setting empress well this is a luxury um setting very expensive setting it could be a club or maybe some, you know, some luxury hotel in the lobby or maybe, maybe, maybe at some buffet, you would enjoy your meal or having a chat with your friends. This person would literally go there, going, would be visiting there, of course, like you are doing, and they would meet you. They would literally watch you from far off. You literally would be looking like a goddess, like so beautiful. And this is extremely luxury setting, very, very expensive uh, hotel you are sitting in, in your future. I can see it, okay? And also, I can see your dress, you, your desktop, like your favorite dress. Could be maybe a skirt, frog, or maxi, or maybe it's a random suit. Mm -hmm. And your hair, hair are curly, wavy. Mm. <sighs> Down shoulders. Oh my gosh, you were literally looking so stunning in that very day. You were enjoying your favorite meal, your favorite cuisine. And or maybe having a glass of champagne, you never know. And this person showed up, asked you literally that what you want, like you know, if you want them, stuff like that. They would ask you for date, or maybe maybe just randomly ask you for your number. Mm -hmm. This is such a you know precious thing. I can see candlelight, I can see so much lighting all around, such a cool, calm place beautiful place such a beautiful it could also be um that um what to say like um you see the private lobby for um business class passengers you know that very area maybe you are sitting there waiting for your next flight you see they could show up there as well mm, business class lounge yeah that's the exact uh, name 
so this is what i can see here so nine of cups oh my gosh you see everything is so luxury about you pile number three so luxury oh my god you were looking like elite and you are you are elite at that very time that's why university wants you to literally focus on your own self and your career right the nine of cups <laughs> such a wish fulfillment nine of cups is your new love and you are you know when you take care of yourself and when you are good to go for a new life this is satisfaction your wish fulfillment and an extremely extremely luxury lifestyle Oh my gosh, this is now insane, King of Wands. I knew it, I literally knew it, you know, King of Wands would come because the way you're looking there, this person is literally going to be falling for you, for your looks and for your styles, and you know, you are holding that um, branded handbags or, you know, even if you are not into brands, still you do have a very, you know, high class and everybody can sense it. Every can feel the vibe of it when you are a classy person, okay? So that's why this person would be literally, literally get attracted towards you with the king of wands and feeling quite passionate about you. And king of wands is always very powerful person by themselves and, you know, very respectful one. But the way you are going to be looking so, so attractive and this person is literally going to be falling for you for how you look like and, you know, for all that style and stuff and you see the magical appearance of yours in your in their life and, you know, overall, the way you own that area or see that class, the, um, your styled stuff. So <laughs> this is so, so lovely and so charming. So, five of pentacles. <laughs> maybe they would be feeling as if maybe you are but like too much on your own self and maybe you're going to be rejecting their proposal. They literally have zero percent hope of expecting a yes from you. That's why this person is not feeling quite confident about your answer. But this is five of cups reverse. I believe by number three, you would accept their proposal after, you know, maybe dating them or stuff like that. And um, their fears are going to be fading away and they would be happier after knowing that, you know, that you have finally said yes to them. Okay, five of cups. This person does have um, passive income sources. Maybe having a lot of properties, collecting events from them, or maybe they do invest in certain things, maybe in some stock markets or uh, maybe, maybe they do have multiple properties or real estate. That's why this person works from home or maybe they do have personal business and they're quite okay with it like literally satisfied with their income streams like multiple income streams this is such a such an elite couple you know <laughs> oh my gosh i'm so impressed so good days are not far away pal number three the chariot one you guys are going to be travel a lot maybe you are a travel lover quite passionate about catching flights okay so uh, this chariot energy traveling together maybe a world tour you never know also i can see airports i can see a setting where um you see elite class is coming you see i'm not being materialistic but the thing is that you have worked so hard in on your own self that now you deserve all that stuff and you have created all that life for your own self right so this is your own hard work not anybody's you know favor upon you right so this is your fruit this is your blessing so just embrace it okay let's see more the world in reverse so pile number three i believe one of you would be introverted while the other is extroverted okay but there is compromise there's you know waiting for other person to uh, literally 
express their feelings and acting on it you see i can see a lot of sacrifice i can see a lot of you see uh, respecting others opinion so this is what i know about your connection right so let's see group number three what else is coming up in your relationship worthiness you worth it okay and even if you are in your 30s okay it's okay it is okay the divine timing has arrived and this embrace this opportunity you worth this very lifestyle the luxury lifestyle mm -hmm. so this is re reparenting yourself take care of yourself okay and also this person is also coming up to literally uplift you emotionally giving you mental support and literally making you feel worthy but literally listen listen to your intuition listen to your gut feeling and never put all your efforts and energies to others right you need to focus on yourself because I can feel, group number three, you are an empath or maybe a star seed or maybe a fallen angel. You absorb the outer energies so fast. That's why you always feeling like drained. I feel not having like um, proper or like energy to do something stuff right because other people they're coming to your life taking all your energies feeding upon your own like stuff and like energies and not taking care of you this is so frustrating for you and then you feel drained right the gardener but this person is taking care of you okay they are not an energy vampire they are coming to save you emotionally like helping you to get out of mental traumas if you do have any right other thing is emotional freedom they are quite um open-minded person right quite open-minded person and they are going to be respecting your emotional state like however you feel like okay hmm this is connection you both are getting connected okay so you see this person is getting connected to you on a spiritual realm okay this could be your past life soulmate as well and uh, if we tell you some signs that they are the one the first time you would meet them or you met them they were wearing blue black or a red shirt okay and that was an evening time yeah an evening time right so let's move ahead and see some charms and other stuff for pile number uh three but let me tell you the time frame first of all that when are you going to be meeting them as i told you before that it's the time when you are at the peak of your career of you being like your best version of yourself right so now it depends upon you that how much you time how much you take time to reach up to that very level but let me tell you one thing more that group number three it is not going to be taking too much time because energies are aligning aligning with your future aligning with your destiny okay and it's all about how ready you you are okay to uh, accept this challenge or you know make things up but uh you see uh, most of the people they you know comment down below that you know what if we could not if we could not make it all like if you could not get success in life then it means that we are not going to be getting your future spouse no it's not like that of course then it's your different path it's a different alignment right whatever you choose for yourself right of course how you think like 
your situation is going to be exactly like that right so think positive even if you could not make all that stuff still you are you you are the blessed and you literally would attract however you would feel like what kind of vibrations you would be having right so as far as your time frame is concerned i can see the 13 number and 6 number right now six number maybe the june month or maybe 13 if you round it up it's april june or april month is quite important and from six to 13 months the coming six to 13 months are extremely crucial to make all that stuff happen or at least initiate your energy your journey okay so let's see some charms and other stuff So well, let's see more. Group number three. Well, this is the two second number, the two, which is the one union, right? The union is going to be happening, and this is what I know. This is the queen crown. So you are the queen. Of your person or maybe your own like life heart so maybe you are hurt right now this is love true love is coming music so maybe they'll belong to some music industry or maybe you are going to pursuing your music career Pisces daydreaming like future is yours okay this is eiffel tower which is paris so maybe you're going to be meeting them at paris like you know you never know at some restaurant or maybe some cozy cafe you never know five number which is the number of change the transformation right this is a love sudden love and literally, this person is going to be falling for you. <laughs> this is such a thunderbolt. I love you. This is love can fashion. Again, this is Scorpio energy. Mm, this person is going to be chasing you like nobody else. Again, Pisces energy, pair of fish. Also tells me that this person would be falling for you for your caring personality and the dancers are very emotional penguin with the friendship energy and diamond Ooh, maybe it's the diamond shop you were there to buy some jewels like diamond jewelry for you you never know pair of earrings or maybe a necklace you never know or maybe a maybe a hand bracelet you never know oh my gosh i got another diamond Oh my god, this is such a luxury pile. I'm so impressed. Oh my gosh, pile number three. You can see these two diamonds. So, diamond does have a connection with your connection. Oh, connection with your connection. <laughs> connection with your relationship, right? So, this is attachment. Also, this is 12 number, which is like coming December. And Aries, so this person is so passionate for you. I know once they are into you, they are going to be winning you at any cost. Still, you are so expensive already. Since, <laughs> since you are expensive already, and you know, to impress you is a different, you know, task. Such a difficult task for them. But I believe they would win your heart. Right? So I hope you enjoyed your reading. It was lovely having you here. And I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.